What is going on you guys? Welcome to today's video. I'm going to show you exactly how to set up the Facebook pixel and actually install it into your Go High Level website the correct way. I'm currently on the business.facebook.com backslash events manager page. I'll put the link in the description for you guys. We are in our main business dashboard here. If you guys don't have a business page yet, you guys do need to set up a, a, a Facebook business page inside of my entire free course inside of Allier agencies i actually show you guys how to do that but you're going to see a similar page as well as long as you guys do have a pixel set up in the first place i'm not going to go over that in this video because this video would wind up being like 20 minutes long and i want to keep it concise to the title which is how to actually integrate your pixel and to go high level you guys can find other videos on how to do that if you don't know how to do that already so the first step in all this to actually integrating this into high level is going to add events and then you're going to click on from a new website and click on install the code manually now as you can see, I've actually gone ahead and done all this stuff except configuring web events because I haven't actually done this for my own website, funny enough. I actually did it on my previous SMMA website here, which I have blurred out, but that's why there's no activity. I've never gone ahead and actually configured the events for sites to be triggered and to track everything. So we'll go ahead and do that this video. But like I said, you're gonna go here, you're gonna click on from a new website and click on install code manually. Now. You know, you are gonna get the code here. This is uh, the second step here after you create your pixel. And now what you're gonna do is you're gonna copy this code here and then you're gonna go to high level and go to your website. And you wanna make sure you go and click on the edit homepage. And of course, you know, we could double check we're at the homepage here. But what you're gonna do is you're gonna go to settings up here and then go to tracking code. As you can see, I have no tracking code here, but with this code right here, I copy and pasted it. I'm gonna paste it right here in the header and I'm, I'm gonna blur some stuff out because my pixel information in here but you guys are going to be able to see your own pixel code in here then you're going to click on yes and save and then there you go and save again once again up top and that is just the first main step of integrating facebook's pixel into your website now we're actually going to go ahead and copy and paste a few other scripts and a few other lines of code uh, to track actually certain actions that people are making on our website and being able to just track everything pretty much. You know how Facebook tracks you doing all the stuff? Well, now we're gonna be able to uh, track people on your own website and you know, down the road, we target them if we, if we really want to. Uh, it could really be beneficial to you. So we're gonna go back to the events manager here. And real quick, if you guys haven't already, we are gonna wanna go ahead and click on verify domains and click on verify domain because otherwise you won't be able to set this up yet. And to my knowledge, you actually don't have to set up web events to actually track stuff. I may be wrong on that. The the Facebook gurus may come after me if I'm incorrect on that. To my knowledge, like I just said, I, do, I don't believe you actually have to set up web events to track with what I'm about to show you. But of course, if I'm wrong, drop a comment and I'll make a video following up with other steps you need to do. But this is to my knowledge and this is what I did, this is what I did previously for uh, my old SMMA website and I didn't have any issues. But we're gonna click on the back arrow here and then we're gonna go to add events again and click on from a new website and click on email instructions. We don't really need email instructions, but I'm gonna go ahead and scroll down to install event code. And in event code, you know, they have 17 predefined ways to track and optimize people and just basically spy on people's activity of your website. We're gonna go ahead and click on this because we wanna actually integrate certain codes. And these are the specific event codes that we are actually gonna go ahead and integrate. But for the sake of this video, we're gonna go ahead and track who's actually punching in their information and initiating a checkout. So let's go to my website here and actually look at where we would put this code and what it would look like. And by the way, guys, of course, you guys would get this entire template, entire, uh, it's like an agency template for free. Uh, inside of my actual, and I have a pop-up form for you guys. You guys can automate or change all this information to your own branding, but you guys can actually get access to this by going and joining my own Atlier Agencies just network. We so far have uh, 12 people out of 250 spots taken. But all you gotta do is start the 30 day free trial by clicking on my link going here and then actually clicking on start an extended free trial. Once you guys actually start your free trial, you're gonna get an automatic follow-up with all of the information, which is the course the discord information obviously because if you just join a discord right now you're not going to get access to the private channels what is this going to look like when we go ahead and actually want to go and initiate the checkout and actually track it with facebook's pixel so we're going to click on start now and this is actually the checkout page which they would see they have the 297 per month option or the 12 year or 12 month option 12 years is a long time but they would click on this obviously enter their information and complete the order and then they would be automatically onboarded uh, with my own backend stuff, which you guys also get access to by joining Outlier Agencies. But we actually are gonna go ahead and go to the settings option again and go to tracking code. And we actually are just gonna paste this code right here. All you gotta do is just paste it. But beforehand, since we are dealing with code here in custom code, we need to be 
super nerdy and go ahead and actually <laughs> type uh, script. So this is within the actual brackets of the code here. So then we click on yes and save and then there you go. So that's pretty much it. That's really all you got to do. If you really wanted to, you could definitely go ahead and just copy and paste uh, different codes into the specific pages that you wanted to do. You would just go to a different page, for example, say we go to messaging, right? You know, you would just go to click on you know, settings and tracking code and, you know, repeat the whole thing by doing script and then copying and pasting uh, whatever is appropriate for what you're trying to track and then, you know, do script and then X, Y, and Z code and then script again and then yes, save and save again up top here. So I hope you guys enjoyed today's video and learned something new. And once again, guys, don't forget all our agencies. We still have a spots open. It's completely for free to join and get access to everything. All you got to do is literally start the 30 day free trial for high level if you haven't already. And if you already are a high level member, um, you guys can always upgrade to the SAS pro plan, the 497 plan uh, under me as well. And then you would also get access to all the resources I have. But for now, guys, I'll see you in the next video.